In this video, I'm going to demonstrate how to use an automated external defibrillator. In previous video clips, you've heard me mention an AED, or Automated External Defibrillator. Now I'm going to show you how to use one. These are wonderful machines, which have made a huge difference in the recovery of cardiac arrest victims. Don't be nervous, it's really very easy to use. Research shows that more than 95% of cardiac arrest victims die before reaching the hospital. A victim's chances of survival are reduced by 7 to 10% with every minute that passes without CPR and defibrillation. Few attempts at resuscitation succeed after 10 minutes. Nearly 60% of all cardiac arrests are witnessed so if an AED is nearby, there's a better chance for survival if timely defibrillation occurs. In cities where defibrillation is provided within five to seven minutes, the survival rate from sudden cardiac arrest is as high as 30 to 45%. Other examples show survival rates as high as 86% in some cases. Step one, turn the AED on. Next, take the lid off. Pads, scissors, a razor, and gloves will be tucked inside the lid. The AED will then audibly prompt the rescuer. Stay calm. Check responsiveness. Call for help. Attach defib pads to patients for a test. Don't touch patient. Analyze it. Shock advised. Press flashing shock button. Shock delivered. Start CPR. So just listen and follow directions. The pads have a diagram on them indicating where to place them. But before you can do that, you will notice that scissors are provided to cut the victim's shirt off. If your AED doesn't have scissors, tear the buttons off the shirt. If the victim has a hairy chest, use the razor supplied with your AED to shave the area where the patch is to be applied. And if the victim is wet, use clothing or a towel to dry his or her chest. It's not necessary to be totally dry, though. If the AED advises you that shock is advised, it's important not to touch the victim during the shock. It will loudly say, Shock advised. Don't touch patient. Press flashing shock button. Then push the red heart or electric bolt button once. The AED will prompt you by saying, Rhythm restored or Shock delivered. Start CPR. After every five cycles, or about every two minutes, allow the AED to analyze the rhythm and continue CPR until the emergency medical team arrives. 